What's up? Chef Gucci here for Anywhere Low Fridays. It's all about that prep for the Portuguese bean soup. First off, cook your beans in the shank water. And you can freeze the beans that you don't use later because it's all about that flavor. Then, get a heavy pot, ripping hot. Add a big glug of oil. Dealer's choice. Canola, olive, grab whatever you got. Now, take some onions, carrots, garlic. And I want you to cook it till it turns translucent, all right? Keep it stirring so nothing burns. Now you're going to add some tomato paste and you're going to cook it out. What that means, you're going to just keep on stirring on some medium-low heat until it turns color and gets a little bit of brown, not burnt. If you sell smoke, you it up and you got to start all over. When that tomato paste gets a little bit of brown and gets some nice color there, I want you to add some beer, deglaze it, scrape off all those yummy bits of the bottom and cheers yourself for getting that far. Now as you're cooking your shank, I want you to cook your pasta separately. Get a pot of salty water rolling hot and then add your pasta and cook it out and then I want you to shock it in ice water. That way you're going to add your pasta to the soup as you need it instead of ending up with a big pasta cake. If you know, you know. Now you're going to add your stock and the shank water. I always have some local bone broth up my sleeves and I keep it in the freezer. That way it's all about the flavor once again, just building flavors. Once you season with salt, some good pepper, smoked paprika, and some herbage. Herbage didn't hurt anybody. Add your diced shank and simmer it up till the shank is a little bit of tender. Taste it again. Adjust if you need. Add some more. Finally, take that pasta that you already cooked and add it as needed. After you add your bone broth and your canned tomatoes and you're just about ready, I want you to take that, some diced cabbage and some caldo, potatoes, whatever you got around and put it in that pot. You're going to simmer it till it's done. Tender. Yummy. Check for flavors. Once you're all done seasoning, you get it to where you want. I want you to crack a beer and cheers yourself and have a melikalikimaka. Mahalo, Olukai. Thanks for having me aboard.